And we're back again. Do do do. Back again. So we're just gonna carve some righteous justice into their skulls. Righteous justice, I say. Uh, we'll leave Mordecai there. We'll let Mordecai and Lath draw out the general. Because he has a fairly large movement range, so it's very easy to not think he can get you. And then he really can. And he'll get somebody, and yeah, it's not good, so... What's his movement range? We'll be fine. Um. Oh gosh, she's almost out of. All right, so she's not gonna go over there after all. I guess I'll send like Oscar, or Titania, or somebody, because she's about to run out. The good thing about Lath and Mordecai's transformation gauges is that they they like counterbalance each other. Like, you know, Lace starts the battle out transformed, and then when she's about to run out, then Mordecai will transform, and by the time Mordecai's about to run out, Lace will transform again, so... You know, it balances each other. They complete each other. That's sickening, why did I say that? Yes, good. You hit a horsey. Good, good job, Oscar. Applause, applause, applause. Okay, so, um, Titania can stay nearby. All you guys ought to be safe to move a little bit this way so that, um, guy right there can't get you, so. And Boyd can come forward a little bit. And yeah, let's see if it worked. Come to us. Yes, 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 it did. As you can see, he has a bow. Hmm. Not, not a particularly strong bow. I would say. But of course, you know, more swordsmen. Or not swordsmen, horsemen. One which does have a sword that I saw. Another level up for Oscar. Yeah, we should be getting a class change very, very shortly, so you guys can... I'll be sure to let you guys see it for your, for, for yourselves as soon as I get one. Alright, so Lath is done, so she needs to stay back here. Um, let's finish this dude off. He's chased us for long enough, so give the dude what he wants and kill him. I kind of feel sorry for him. He ran all the way over here, and I'm just gonna like wipe the floor with him. Sucks to be him, for sure. Uh, we'll let Mia do it. Cause she needs healing anyway, so she can get some more experience and then get some more HP. So it'll level up though, so it'll be okay. Miss needs the experience. I've been putting some uh, bonus experience into her, so. Oh, we'll let him attack. He's really not that tough of a general. Because, you know, he can't fight back unless it's his turn. Or you attack him with somebody you shouldn't attack him with, so I can finish him off with an iron. So yeah, this level is pretty much in the bag. Not too much left to do. He can finish off his steel lance, I guess. next time if he ever decides he feels like hitting ever again 
You're not Kieran. You're the one that's supposed to hit. She can finish off hers too. And I'll let her have the probably the rest of the two at the top because I really don't feel like messing with them. So. I'll just let her handle things. As soon as she gets her level up. Uh, she got even more HP. Well, or she could not go very far. Everybody else can charge forward because there isn't much chance of death anymore, so. Who is it? Tell him I'll call him back. Is this my team? Sorry. He said he called back with me. Okay. 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 Sorry about that. I had to, um, Dad came in. Alpha, uh, that Alpha called me, so. I'll call him back though. My bad. Anyways, the Black Knight's here. But as long as you don't leave a unit over there like a moron, it should be okay. Because he doesn't like move towards you as long as you don't move towards him. Which is a very, very bad idea by the way. This could, this should kind of go without saying, but you can't kill the Black Knight here, so no matter what you do, you're going to do zero damage and he, you, that character you attacked with will die, like guaranteed. It for sure they are dead. Adios. So I think I'm just gonna end the level as soon as this dude's dead. I think I'll end it with Titanium. So then we can watch a cutscene because it's a fairly good one. It's all right. So we'll just end it here. It's just a priest. So. Alright, so we're done here. Here comes the Black Knight strolling along. Oh, but here comes Renolf. Not going to let him mess with our ship. Hmm. And yeah, the Black Knight's pretty interested in fighting him. Here it goes. Renault versus the Black Knight. Who will win? Ooh. That looked pretty tough, but... Ah, oh, that looks tougher. Ow. Try again? No, 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 nothing. Owie. Renolf can't even hurt him. Oh, but what was that? A healing spell? A physics staff, maybe? I haven't shown those off yet, but they can heal from a distance. It's that guy we saved from the prison. What's he doing here? Wherever he is, the Black Knight seems kind of scared of him. I wonder. Anyways, the Wyvern Knights are, um, besides basically being the Pegasus Knights, but for Dan. And then they want to chase after us, but, you know, Commanding Officer Har is just not into it. Hmm. Eh, he just kind of pwned you there. So there's a uh, Norris, another general. Hmm. But again, Sephirin is pretty uh getting him. 
And yeah, the Black Knights, they're gonna let us go. Why? Why would they do that? But who cares? Because, you know, we're home free. I'll skip through this one. Somebody told them that uh, they saw Princess Alencia. And in exchange, they get worked like slaves. Alright, so, you know, we made it to sea, so we're home free, right? Sadly, no, we're not. But I'm going to end this video here, so... Um, join us next time. We'll be taking on the next level. Uh, yeah, stay tuned.